once again your soulmate charm and it's a lovely day today it's kind of cold still two degrees outside a bit sunny and cloudy so i'm happy today and for today's video guys i'll be sharing to you um my first time meet with my boyfriend my trip in maldives last 20 um 21 if i'm not mistaken <laughs> so yeah but before i go any further shout out to all my subscriber in the universe because universe guys no congratulations to our miss universe miss usa <laughs> so yeah um thank you for all my subscribers for supporting me in the philippines salamat maayong buntag in denmark mangita good morning and again to all good morning and thank you thank you so much so by the way i'm all dressed up today because later we'll go to the job center probably i will share a video for that but i'm not promising um makichismis lang me dito unsay mga work available maybe a little assessment unsa ang work na available for me because morag na board na gamay yung auntie no two months na ko wala work very plain housewife lang ta padako sa now padako sa lawas pabuhi kita tag anggol nga gamay atong now but anyways um so um how was my first time meeting my boyfriend so nag meet me sa maldives no by the way maldives guys wala siya visa um visa and arrival russia so tatakan rin yung passport about dito so same process you need to make sure your passport is at least six months valid pa siya so kung less than six months please mga ang kolog ante paki renew na na kay mahirap na so there um pandemic man to nag meet me no so it was a bit complicated um daghan kay maybe na process daghan daghan requirements including balo na mo mga covid test dihang dapita and ang anxiety level na mo are to both me and my husband is really on top of our lungs <laughs> on top of the world because daghan kay may mga nabasa mga ano on, online nga na decline or na offload or kana positive sa covid blah 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 so but we really took the risk diba kana love conquers all man punuha yang am ang story no so yeah um thankful lang sad ko ato nga meet up because um over prepared a bit over prepared ko ato guys so for my requirements i had my passport um i had my cfo certificate so because i read online you needed that was for first time meet up so ako lang siyang gina process just to make sure um and then na apod koy invitation or not invitation but proof of support and guarantee ng akong um, boyfriend ang mag gasto sa tanan nga gasto um, sa among pag meet and then what else um na kay fill out online for like pandemic thingy during that time for Maldives so there and um actually i was just like overthinking at you know okay during the time of the flight nako ang nakatabang jud nako is ang akong flight ako ang flight history to taiwan so um it really helped me kaya na flight history and tip lang guys when you go to immigration no wala ni nako na share sa akong previous video but if possible, go to a male immigration officer. Okay, walay daghan ni kuti guys. Unlike mga babae, daghan kay questions. So, 
there so um the immigration officer just asked me about um proof of relationship so wala pa man minag meet no kay first time meet pa man to na nako na with my husband so um ako lang gina share ang amo ang chat conversation online so iyang nako printed but the immigration officer choose to check my phone so kita and then ang siya passport copy sa akong boyfriend and what else itinerary of course uh, round trip ticket hotel booking um proof of employment leave letter certificate of employment my id company id he asked for it he asked for my credit cards he asked for my bank statements supposed to be it was my boyfriend who will finance it but he asked but good thing i have those ready as well um unfortunately uh cfo or um, invitation letter or support of finance or guarantee whatever letter wala niya gina ask so yeah nara ako na lang siyang gina say so yeah but what really helped me guys is my taiwan nga, um travel history he even asked his supervisor is this good to go and then this boy, yes, because he has already a flight history. So, that too, guys, naka help siya. And then, also, COVID, the yeah, COVID test. You need to submit that during that time. Luckily, negative rin yung auntie, no? Nakuya one, she got positive. Oh, well. But anyways. <laughs> so, yeah. I was happy. So, katulang, guys. Um... Maldives is really nice. Unfortunately, nagastay lang mi sa Delicia Resort. Delicia ka tong halon nga resort. Nagastay lang mi sa Maduos Airport. Unfortunately, naasalay lang at tong dili pwede mag PDA, dili pwede pakita o skin. Mang sa Muslim, Shar, Sharia, I don't know the place ako. Basta ka nung lawn nila. But in the resort, guys, which you will ride a ferry pa going there, kanang allowed siya. So, so wala. Dilipod ka pwede mo inom yung mga liquor dito. And less na ka sa katong um, first class resort or whatever they call it. So, Maldives is nice. It's just like Philippines, guys. But for me, if I'm going to compare it, Philippines is still better um but the reason why we chose it is because open sila tong a time okay kabalo na mo pandemic a lot of destinations are closed or were closed so sila open sila and then wala visa so and then it's accessible both for me and my boyfriend that time so kato ang amung ginapili so also that time we are ready if ever I'm offload or if not allowed to board of flight ready na mi ato but thank god we saw each other and the rest is history um that's my experience and my first meetup with my husband so that's for today uh, video guys i hope you get some tips and information about uh, meeting your boyfriend for the first time especially for those long distance relationship um don't be afraid guys take risk um and also make sure that uh wag dalos dalos um make sure to really get to know the person so that's it for today guys and again thank you for, to all of my subscribers so wala pa nag subscribe please go share like and comment below for more videos bye, -bye.